Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Kale here right from the rise and welcome to my channel! So I'm gonna tell you about my predictions when I was in this Mama Show Theater Musical Restaurant or whatever it was. So um, before I went there I was on my way to the train and um, just walking, I was like one hour too early. But I was waiting outside this ABBA museum, pre pretty close to uh, Granalund in Stockholm, Sweden. And uh, <coughs> and I was waiting there. My mom and sister came from the boat. I didn't know if they come with a car or if it come with a train as well. I was waiting on the other side. I thought they would come with a train, so I was waiting on the other side. I, I didn't have the thought about the boat. So they were, I was walking there, and they were coming with a boat, and um, they were saying they were waiting in the line, but I'm here. But I was the one who was in the wrong, I'm standing in the wrong side, in the wrong road, so so I was <laughs> walking around the house, but no, it's ABBA Museum, right here. I mean, Mamma Mia is ABBA, right? But they was like hiding in the corner, pretty close to where you... Um, riding the boat through the water, so there they were waiting. So I went there. There was my mom and my sister. So we went in. We didn't have to use. The... So when we went in there, when we went in there, it was pretty cozy and beautiful. Like, oh, okay. I mean, I mean, I had no idea I would find that place was hiding in the corner. So when we went in, we were. Looking it was pretty like flower and, and leaves and all this on the walls, and there was a little small band playing some ukulele and guitar. Whatever, I don't know what he's saying. So we went in, we um, gave them our jackets. We need to get dressed off, not naked though, <coughs> I need clothes. Um, uh, so what's it now? We took it from tickets. No, 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 no tickets. We are on a vacation now. Welcome to Greece. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, okay. In Stockholm, we're in Greece. Ah, oh, okay. So I guess we were in Greece then. So, <laughs> so when we went in, the um, the the room was very, very beautiful. I mean, when I was having these tickets, like. Musical thing, Mamma Mia, this was far away from what I expected. I thought it we would sitting low, like usually, sitting in chairs, people in chairs, like in opera or something, and just watching a scene there, but no, it was far away from what I expected. When we went in there, there was a lady with some sun chair here, whatever we call it, and the had some sunglasses, I don't know if she had a drink, but it had some sunglasses, maybe some drink, I don't remember. It's like, oh, doing the sunshine now on the beach, like, <laughs> okay. And after that, we could pick up some some uh, shots. Yeah, there were three different shots I just picked up what uh, my family picked, so. <laughs> and then we take a table, we had a table. And the table <coughs> was nice. So we were sitting three in the table and there was four more next to us in the same table. We were sharing the table. And there was so much stuff in our table. It was so much stuff. We couldn't like uh, reach it there. What are we gonna do? <laughs> How am I supposed to, to, to do something here? This is too much. It's just like a mess in the table, such a mess. But there was a lot of appetites in there, and we ordered beers and drinks. And um, now the food was uh, was with the tickets, but you have to pay for the drinks. So um, so we were sitting there, appetites, and then when they. They took off the first appetite, and then they just served more appetite. Then they took off that, and then they served another more of appetite. Like, oh my god, more? <laughs> it never ends. And they had this, at the same time, they had um, a show. 
It was like this room was like a restaurant. Um, it was flower, and it was a fountain. Do you do you call it a fountain? <laughs> and there was another bar disc over there and another bar disc over there. Now the bar disc over there was the real chefs who made the food rather. Right? The bar disc over there was used for the theater show. They were like having a show everywhere. So when you were seating, we have to turn around, watch that show, and then they were suddenly there, and suddenly up there was some balcony there and there. They have the show there too. They have like show everywhere, <laughs> and um, and sometimes when the show was ending, there were some people coming and had some shows on the restaurant anyway, just for fun, just. Uh, the show was not, it was just a pause, but people just wandered around and played like drunk or um, were supposed to swim or you know, like that. Just acting around while the rest of the people, guests, eating our food. And they had a lot of different shows. And then they came the surf, and the surf. Was pretty good. Well, the food was. Wait, should I tell you what the appetite was? The appetite we had was some fish, some um, some tomatoes, some different tzatziki and so sauces and all stuff. It sounds it sounds disgusting or weird in, from my words, but it, when you see it, it was delicious. When you taste it, it was delicious. The 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 main. The main lunch, the main dinner, ooh, uh, the, the dinner, uh, the real food. It was meat and some vegetables and potatoes, you know, like barbecued, kinda. Now the dessert was, state there was some. I don't know what it was. I, I know what it was, but I don't know the name of that. Not in Swedish either. So, but it was one things, and with that it was was some white dessert. For me, it tasted like yogurt. And it's like, what? Why does it taste like yogurt? <laughs> it, is that how Greece is uh, serving desserts? Yogurt? We eating yogurt for breakfast. <laughs> okay. So, I don't know. I, I was expecting dessert was should, supposed to be more delicious. Not just tasting yogurt, but that's typical Greece, I guess. But what the musical show was about a guy and a girl in love with each other, but they never connected really, and um, pe people needed help to, you know, to make them to together in a play role, of course. So that was. But the funny thing was, it was two things I missed. I I filmed I filmed it, and there was two things I missed. I mean, there was yeah, there was about this guy who, who was playing Adam, the who, the character who was in love with this girl. So <clears throat> there was two things. He was dancing on her on his own body, like do da da do da di da di day da di do da di di da di do. When I turned my camera on the other way, he was falling down. Now, he didn't fall down with purpose. Uh, wait, yes. It, what am I saying? Yes, he did fall down with purpose. Now, he was supposed to fall down in purpose because that was his play role to do that. Like, ooh, falling down. And I just missed it because it was pretty funny though. It was not purpose or with purpose. I would... I would film that, but I just turned my camera to this freaking grandma, like, oh shit, <laughs> oh shit, I missed. <laughs> shit, I missed. And the other scene was when he was on, on standing on the fountain, 
and splashing out a lot of water. And then later, just when I closed close the camera, he was doing this and they were spreading out fire from the fountain. Like fire. Oof. And and I felt I felt the hot. I oh my god. I was pretty we were pretty close to the fountain. And god damn it, I felt the warm in my body. Like, you know, oh shit, <laughs> the, holy, so I missed it, it was really, really awesome, that was epic to see the fire, fortunately I closed the camera, I thought it would do more for him, but no, and then when the server gone, they warned us that they're gonna put the off the table and um, make us dance on the floor and then make together in the table they're gonna stand there and do some disco and concerts and do 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 for me it's like i mean it is fun but it's like forcing people out of the table i mean I, that day it wasn't my, really my dance day i mean i can dance now a little bit you know but just that day wasn't my day to dance well i was tired <laughs> Uh, and I, I didn't feel to dance that day, and I, I feel like why I want to sit there in pub and my mom like come on come on, ah oh, then I have no choice, so we do this freaking st stupid ridiculous dance, but um so but I was like what are what those up there they sitting in the balcony. Did you didn't force them to dance here that there was few people up there what about uh, maybe I wanted to be on the uh, table sitting at a table or something else I don't know it's like for me it's like forcing people up to dance I don't like that the show was ending the people were still dancing they were dancing and um, yeah they were just dancing. And uh, I used to avoid my dancing. I was standing there filming my sister dance. And then uh, later, yeah, I'm sh shake a little bit. Then you have to go to the bathroom to avoid the dance a little bit. But I ne needed to go to the bathroom as well. But I used to avoid the dance too. And then I went back and just watched people dance. But, <laughs> but then, then after that, when I... <laughs> Come back from the bathroom. My she, my mom and sister like, hey, she sister forget the bag. Wait, oh my god, my sister, oh, always forgetting something. She is so messy. She always forgets something. My sister always forgets something. Like, like a bag. You know, in my home, she forget toothbrush. Uh, Toothpaste and, and and dog food and probably other stuff and, uh, in the in this party. Oh man, what did I do with my bag? You you need you need to take care of your important black small bags. No 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 no. It's it's gone. It's gone. But then someone to take care of it and lucky her, she got her freaking bag. Well, it's her own fault. <laughs> so, yeah. So my predictions. How much did I like uh, Mia show? How many points? Okay. F from 0 to 10. Well, um, I was a little disappointed about the dessert. So they're losing one point there. Because it's dessert is not supposed to taste yogurt. Yeah, probably in Greece. Yeah, welcome to Greece. But I don't like Greece deserving yogurt. We Swedish people want real dessert, not a yogurt. We eat that for breakfast, god dang it. And second of all, you're losing one point for forcing people dancing and just take it off. Everybody doesn't want to dance. Respect that. And um, so that that is eight points. <laughs> eight points. So... 
of going on music culture show or something like that. But I appreciate, and it was pretty fun. You know what? Every every musical theater is gonna lose a point for me not being a fan of it. So we're doing this. So let's say this. <clears throat> it was good. It was a good show. I give that seven out of a ten. Well, back home from Greece, I guess. Well, that's for me. I will see you guys. In the next better video than this one. Stay cool, everybody. Stay cool. <laughs> I just realized when I watched your video, this lady walking behind past my sister have actually the same shirt.